what was it? Was there one moment that made you say, aha, I should be involved in politics, I should vote, and it was it just because you personally wanted to run for office, or was it something else entirely? I think it was just a, a maturation that happens with your experience, especially me in public service. And, you know, with my experience, seeing more the ability that government can have a positive, that, that there is an ability for the government to have a positive effect. But remember, in my early years, there was a disillusionment there that over time I began to say, you know what, I think that there is a better way that, that government can serve uh, communities and individuals. And I actually have thrown my hat in the ring more than most people ever will in a lifetime in a way that is very uh, critical and under the gun and, and under the spotlight. And I open my life up to that kind of scrutiny because I think that public officials should open their, per, their uh, life up to that kind of scrutiny. And I have done that very openly and honestly. And again, no one has the record of fighting for families, for children, for women, for chi uh, victims of child abuse, domestic violence, for the taxpayer, for consumers. No one has fought harder to level the playing field in our communities. I'm not just talking, Liz, about talking the talk. I'm talking about walking the walk. Okay. No one in this race has done that more than I have.